Well, from middle America to the middle of France, Matt Damon's latest movie takes you on the journey of a father trying to save his young daughter from a dreadful life in prison. But the long journey is paved with lots of good intentions and bad decisions. Good Day's Portia Bruner recently spoke to Matt Damon and his co-stars about the movie Stillwater. I loved her. I know you did. But everybody thinks that I killed her. Stillwater is the story of a troubled father trying to help his troubled daughter who got in big trouble with the law. Matt Damon plays Bill, an oil rig worker from Oklahoma who's desperate to get his daughter Allie released from prison in a small city south of Paris. You can see that he's, he's carrying kind of some baggage from a past, that he has a history of kind of messing things up. And, and yet he has this impulse to try to help his daughter uh, with, with none of the kind of the tools or the skills that he would need to help her. And he really has this impulse to, because of all of the pain and the shame and the guilt that he carries around having failed his daughter and failed that relationship, he's doing what he can to repair it. But in doing what he can to repair it, Bill puts others in harm's way. There are a couple clear points in the movie where you go, oh, please, please don't do that. Please, Bill, don't do that. Um, you know, it, but you see it coming. I learned something new, actually. It's helped me a lot. There's also a part of her that sees they're both kind of messed up in their own ways. And um, I think towards the end, they, they realize that they have a lot more in common with each other than, than they thought. Abigail Breslin portrays Allie. They're, they're trying their best, but they're somehow not getting it right and I think anybody can can relate to that and I felt so humiliated. ultimately but it does raise really the point as a parent how far will you go right. director Tom McCarthy you know, loosely based the story on the legal troubles of Amanda Knox the young American woman who was convicted in Italy of her roommate's death in 2009 then released from prison in 2015 but McCarthy says Stillwater focuses more on the fictional relationship between Bill and Allie and how even good intentions can lead to bad decisions. What are the consequences when uh, people act with one specific mission like that? When they say, no matter what, this is all I care about. There's real human consequences, emotional, spiritual consequences to that. I'm sorry, I just, I, I can't talk to that guy anymore. Camille Cotin plays Virginie, the French woman who does her best to help Bill, even at her own peril. She sees a father who wants to be a good person and who wants to be a good father. And I think this is something that strikes her immediately as being a single mom raising alone her, her child. And Matt Damon told me he hopes Stillwater challenges viewers to look closely at issues of culture, class, and the justice system. If you look at, at the end of the film, where Bill is and what he loses, Trust me. you know, it kind of depends on how, I, I would say, how you're defining, defining justice in that context. And, and I'm interested to hear what people, what people think. The film is very much about how, we're, how Americans are perceived overseas. For Good Day Atlanta, I'm Portia Brun. Our thanks to Focus Features for help coordinating those interviews. Stillwater is in theaters tomorrow.